you're single. So what you're telling me is you're single? Oh, who's the special guy in your life? You're single? Why is you single? Nuh-uh. Oh, I'm sorry. Not you. I won't believe it. You can't be single. Girl, don't worry about it. He's coming. He's on his way. You can't be single. You're single. I know you got a man, right? You're single? Come on, you're single? My name is Patricia and welcome to the Singles Club. Hey guys, how y'all doing? It's been a minute since I came with, uh, to you guys with a singles video, singles club video. Really excited to bring it to you guys today. How you guys doing? Y'all doing good? I'm doing good too. All right, so let's get right into it. This actually was sparked by a video that I saw right here on YouTube. I'm going to post that video down below and I want you to watch it. I want everyone who's watching this video to watch that video. It was actually my second rebuke on this particular topic. Now this is a difficult one to talk about. I wanna make sure to convey um, the message that's in my head without it being interpreted the wrong way, which is difficult for this type of um, topic. All right, so some of y'all, not all of you guys, some of y'all are entirely too picky. You walk around on high horses expecting to get Mr. Perfect, but let me tell you something, it just might not happen for you. Or maybe I shouldn't say it like that. Maybe Mr. Perfect doesn't look like the way you want him to. Those of you guys who are subscribed to my vlog channel know that I've recently been on a cruise with uh, two of my friends and my sister. A lot of our conversations surrounded um, relationships, among other things as well, work, school, things like that. Um, but a lot of our conversations surrounded relationships and this is something that my sister brought to my attention. She said to me, you know, he may not look like the way you you want him to. He may not be 6'5", tall, chocolate, brings you roses and serenades you from your window at two o'clock in the morning. Like, that might not all happen for you. Not because I don't deserve it, but that's not the person that God has for you. You have to be willing to grow with someone. So why should you expect him to be? You ever heard the saying, he might not be perfect, but he'll be perfect for you? Yeah, there's some truth to that. Everyone comes with issues. Everyone comes with baggage. Everyone comes with flaws. Nobody's perfect. So best believe your future husband is gonna have some flaws. The question is, is that the person that God has for you? Is that the person you're supposed to be with? Is that your soulmate? Some of you out there, some of your standards are so high, not even Jesus could date you. Now I'm not passing judgment on anyone because like I said, I was recently rebuked in this department. You need to be open to whoever it is that God has for you. And honestly, he might not meet everything on your list. God knows you best. He knows what to bring you, what not to bring you. He knows the exact person that's gonna accomplish you that's gonna bring the good out of you he's gonna bring you that person that you can help grow you can help nurture and vice versa basically what I'm telling you guys is mr. Wright may not look like the way you want him to mr. Wright may have some flaws and best believe he gonna come with some baggage when he comes make God the center of your relationship he'll bring you together he'll be the glue now I don't want you guys thinking oh Patricia says you need to be with any and everybody and yes it's very very important to have standards but at the same time be open to who it is that God wants in your life don't be so closed out that you miss out on the best thing to ever happen to you don't be so closed out that you miss your blessing I hope you guys get what I'm saying I'm not saying don't have any standards open the door and let any old body walk in no that's what I'm saying what I'm saying is be open have an open heart and allow God to bless you with the person, the perfect person that he has for you. Not because he's perfect and not because he doesn't have any flaws or he doesn't come with baggage, but because he's perfect for you. Simple message. Hope you guys got it. Let me know what you guys think down below. Hit me up on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. All my links will be down below. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys are doing well and in good spirits whenever it is that this video meets you. And I'll see you guys next time in another video. And as always, God bless. All right, guys, so did you guys miss my last video on my skincare regimen? Check that out here. Also, don't forget to hit me up on my vlog channel for more fun. All the links you need will be down below. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.